Good Monday morning to you. I think we get another great day today, but what a weekend with those low 70s on Saturday and the upper 60s on Sunday. Abundant sunshine throughout, and I think we're going to be clear this morning with lots of sunshine for your Monday. Now, it was 39 last hour, but currently it is 41. We'll waver back and forth a tad. The dew points in the upper 30s. The air is calm, and there's certainly been no rain. 35 in Lawrence, that's our cool spot. Manhattan's at 38. A bit of an anomaly here with Holton at 47, holding a bit of warmth, and Kansas City's at 46, down toward Emporia, 43 right now. And the dew points are low, allowing the air temps to cool on down in many locations, and there might be a little hit of fog or frost as well. So some clouds up north with light showers heading toward Rapid City and just north of Pier. Here come some clouds from Denver over toward Goodland, and these high clouds will certainly start spreading in. So I think we get sunshine, but also high clouds kind of sweeping across the sky. A southerly wind today, I think at 15 to 25 miles per hour. And then tomorrow it's going to be just the opposite. We're going to tap into a northerly breeze, making it cooler. We're going to have showers with cloud cover, and so it's going to feel much cooler, I think, than low 60s. So as we go through the day today, we'll have some high clouds from time to time. Everything kind of thickens up and increases as we go through the nighttime period. And by early morning tomorrow. We should have some showers develop, but a lot of this is going to be across I-70 south the way it appears. Still might be a shower in the northern counties, but much of it might be Manhattan, Topeka, Lawrence to Kansas City. And then as we hit the late day period, that kind of shuts down. So there should be about a six to eight hour period where there could be some rain. And then even on Wednesday, a lot of cloud cover in the area that might break up from time to time, but I think mainly cloudy could be a sprinkle. But as we hit trick or treat time in that five to eight o'clock period, for Wednesday night, the clouds gradually decrease. It may stay overcast in Emporia. I think it becomes partly cloudy in Topeka and mainly clear from Manhattan north. And so it could work out to be a pretty good trick or treat time with temps in the upper 40s to low 50s. And of course, the later somebody's out, the cooler it's going to be. So sunny, breezy today at 73 degrees. Might be hard to kind of stay focused on the task at hand with weather like that. And then increasing clouds as we go through the overnight with mid 50s. So it stays pretty mild. And then tomorrow, showers become likely 62. It should be fairly light rain and not last all day. And then once we get into Wednesday, the clouds, the morning sprinkle, but I think clouds decrease late. 58 the high, and then for Thursday, a mild day at 62, but then cooler weather again, so not nearly as nice for the upcoming weekend as the one we just had. A 53 on Friday, the isolated shower, rather cool on Saturday with low to mid 50s, and it looks like some showers become likely again on Sunday. And don't forget the time change occurs this weekend before bed Saturday night. We're going to set those clocks back one hour. And we still have at least two hours plus with our program. It's KSNT News on a Monday morning, and we'll see you in just a moment.